So, to make these lines, I will need a gear knot of lead lights. Here we go. In my chain we have 16 lights, so obviously I will need 16 ping pong balls. Um, fine cotton yarn, I use Melissa cotton yarn number 5, in any colors you want. I wanted to make a rainbow lights, so obviously I chose these colors. 3 mm crochet hook, usually for this yarn I use 2.5 mm, so I chose a little bit bigger, just that the light can go out easier from our balls, scissors and the cutter. Okay, so first thing that we do is if we have any name on our balls, we can remove it with polish nail remover to have them clean. Now we just take the cutter and make a hole and just across here. Be super careful. The hole doesn't have to be big, just that you can put a light inside. Here we go. Fits perfectly. Now we can start to crochet our hole. So here we go. We start with making a magic ring. Okay. Now we will make six single crochet inside this magic ring. So we have one, two, three, four, five, and six. Now we push the tail to close it and we have to insert our crochet hook into the first stitch that we made. And now without joining with any slip stitch we just start round number two. In every stitch we will make one increase. So in this first stitch we will make one single crochet and another one. We have two in the next one. Number three and number four in the next one. Five and six in the next one. Seven, eight in the next one. Nine and ten, and in this one, last one of this round, eleven and twelve. Okay, we finish round number two. Now we will start round number three, and in this round, we will make one increase and one single crochet in next stitch. One increase, one single crochet. So now we start with one increase. So it will be our first stitch, and second. In the next one, one single crochet, so it will be stitch number three of this round. In the next one, increase, so it will be stitches number four, and five. In the next one, one single crochet, so it will be stitch number six from this round. And here we go, it will be seven, eight. In the next one, nine. In the next one, 10, 11. In the next one, 
12 in the next one 13 and 14 in the next one 15 and the last group 16 17 and one single crochet stitch number 18 here we go so like making any amigurumi here we start with six single crochet in first round later in the second round we have 12 double crochet so it's like just double in the third round we have 18 single crochet so it was one increase and one single crochet in the next one round number four we will make one increase and two single crochets so we start with increase so it will be one and two in the same stitch stitch number three will be in the next stitch and stitch number four in the next stitch so here we go five six in the same one in the next one seven in the next one eight another increase nine in the same one ten and in the next one eleven and in the next one twelve again an increase thirteen fourteen in the next one fifteen and in the next one sixteen increase 17 18 in the next one 19 and in the next one 20 and our last group of this round 21 22 and in the next one 23 and in the next one 24 so here we finished round number four with 24 stitches now we will begin round number five so in this round we will have one increase and three single crochet in the next stitches to have in total 30 stitches so here we go we start with increase so we have one two three in the next one four in the next one and five in the next one so again an increase so it will be stitch number six and in the same one stitch number seven and later three single crochets will be stitch number eight in the next one nine and in the next one ten Again, an increase, 11, 12 in the same one, and we have 13, 14, and 15. Okay, increase, so 16, 17, and three stitches, 18, 19, and 20, an increase, 21, 22 in the same one, and later we have 23 in the next one, 24 in the next one, and 25 in the next one. And the last group in this round, 26, 27 in the same one, and now 28, 
29 and 30. We finished round number 5 and now we will make round number 6. So again we start with an increase and later we will make 4 single crochets in next stitches to make a total of 36 stitches in the end of this round. We start with increase and it will be 1, 2, 3 in the next one, 4 in the next one, 5 in the next one and 6 in the next one. Now again an increase, 7, 8 in the same one, now we have stitch number 9, 10, 11 and 12. Here we go, another increase, 13 and 14 in the same one and here we go with single crochets, it will be 15, 16, 17 and 18. Another increase, stitch number 19 and 20 in the same one, 21, 22, 23, 24, another increase, 25 and 26 in the same one, and now we have 27, 28, 29 and 30. And the last group in this round, an increase, 31, 32, and in the next one, 33, 34, 35, and 36. So next six rounds we will make just one single crochet in every stitch. So we just don't increase anything. So in this round, it's round number seven of our work. We will make one single crochet in every stitch. So here we go. Remember that we had 36 stitches in the last round. So now we have to make again 36 stitches. We have round stitch number one. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19 and 20. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 
and 36. So we finished round number seven. Now rounds number eight, nine, 10, 11 and 12. We just have to repeat this step. So just make 36 single crochets all over during next five rounds. So remember rounds number eight, 9, 10, 11 and 12. And after this I will show you how to start to decrease our ball. So now we are after round number 12. It looks like this. We can put our ball inside. Here we go. And now it's a moment to start to close our bow inside. So we'll leave it here with this hole on the top and we will start to decrease. So this round, round number 13, will make four single crochet and one decrease in every group. Here we go. One, two, three, four, and one decrease. So from two stitches we just make one, this one and this one. And this decrease it will be stitch number five in this round. We will put it in a second. There we go. So again, we have stitch number six, seven, eight, and nine. And again, we will make a decrease. So it will be our stitch number 10 in this round. So put the ball again. Because finally it will be a moment that it will not, it will cannot go out. We'll make again four single crochets, so it will be stitch number 11, 12, 13 and 14. And our stitch number 15 will be a decrease. Again, single crochets, so it will be stitch number 15, uh, 16, 17, 18, 19, and stitch number 20, it will be a decrease. Good. 21, 22, 23, 24, and a decrease, stitch number 25. And we still have to have one group more in this round. So again, four single crochets, so this one it will be stitch number 26, 27, 28, 29, and our last decrease, so it will be stitch number 30. So in this round we made 6 decrease, so from 36 stitches we have now 30. Then we start our round number 14, we made 3 single crochets, 1, 2, Three and a decrease. 
So it will be our stitch number four of this round. Again, single crochets, three. So it will be five, six, and seven. And a decrease it will be our stitch number eight. This round, go. Again, three single crochets. So we have stitch number nine, 10, and 11. And our stitch number 12 is a decrease. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, and the decrease be sixteen. Seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. And a decrease, stitch number 20. And we still need four more stitches, so we have three single crochets, 21, 22, 23, and the last decrease of this round, stitch number 24. Here we go. So in this round, round number 14, from 30 stitches we make 24. So now we'll make two single crochets and one decrease. So from 24 stitches we will have 18. We go to single crochets, have one, two, and a decrease. Three, four, five, and a decrease, six, seven, eight, and a decrease, nine, ten. 11 and a decrease 12 13 14 and decrease 15 and three more stitches stitch number 16 17 and the last one of this round Stitch number 18 is a decrease. So now we have only 18 stitches in the end of this round. We will have to make two more rounds to finish. So you just can see that the hole here is really small right now. So now from 18 stitches we will make 12. So we just work one single crochet and one decrease. So it was one and decrease. It will be our stitch number two. So three will be single crochet and four, it will be a decrease. Five, single crochet and six, a decrease. Seven, it will be single crochet and eight, a decrease. Nine and ten, it's a decrease. And the last two stitches, eleven, it's a single crochet and twelve is a decrease. And now we have 12 stitches, we just have to make one decrease more 
and it will be done. So now we have to just make six decreases. So we have one decrease, two, three, four, five, and six. Here we go. We have here a little hole just to put our light bulb inside. We just block it. Cut it. We can just put this little tail inside. We don't need it also. Okay, here we go. Our little ball, crochet ball. Now we can try how it looks like. We insert our light bulb and here we go. So now we just have to do all the rest of bolts that we have here, put them on the light bulbs and it's ready. <laughs>